Hello everyone, I'm back with another video. Here in this video, we'll discuss how we can create Copilot desktop shortcut in Windows 11. So that's been said, let's get started. Let me tell you that to use Copilot application in Windows 11, you can simply launch it from the task bar, as you can see here. However, if you want a desktop shortcut icon to open Copilot application, then you can simply create a shortcut. For that, on the desktop, right click on it, then click on new and here simply click on shortcut option. Now it will open a window to create a desktop shortcut. To create a desktop shortcut for Copilot, here on type the location of the item, simply type this address. Don't worry, I'll provide this location in the description box. And here give a name to your shortcut. Let me name it as Copilot. Then click on finish button and it will create a copilot application. You can simply click on this shortcut to open your copilot application as you can see here. However, here you can see that we don't have a copilot icon on this shortcut. To change the shortcut icon, simply right click on it, then click on show more option. Here click on properties and it will open copilot properties window. Here simply click on web document. Now to change the shortcut icon, Simply click on change icon button and here you will find few default icon that you can set for copilot desktop shortcut. However, to change it to copilot icon, you have to download one image file. So I'll provide the download link in the description box. Simply visit that link and download the image. After that, simply click on this browse button and browse your download location and simply select copilot icon. Then click on open. Here click on OK, then click on Apply, then click on OK button. After that, you can see we have successfully changed the desktop icon to Copilot. Now you can simply use this desktop shortcut to open Copilot application in Windows 11. So that's it. This is how you can create Copilot desktop shortcut in Windows 11. I hope this video was helpful to you. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe the channel for more videos like this. Bye for now. See you next video.